Now, there is a story that's just sort of breaking at the moment that yep. Jaden Stevenson will actually be available to play for Collingwood's VFL side this weekend yep. against Box Hill. Now, I was under the impression that a 10-week ban Bam. meant 10 yep. weeks, including AFL yeah. and VFL. However, the AFL is saying that the ban ends on Friday night. I think you're entitled to think that, Nat. Um, again, it wasn't a, a tribunal hearing per se, mm. was it? It was an integrity department finding. So they're not bound by, I suppose, the requirements under that 10-week ruling that does apply yeah. under a tribunal. But I'm with you on this. I, I think this is a rorting of this situation. And, and I say rorting because the Collingwood's been smart enough to realise that they're playing on Friday night. Yep. That's the 10th AFL game it he's going to miss. VFL team plays subsequent to Friday night. And if I'm Collingwood, I'm arguing that all day, every day. And I'm going to try and get it through as the AFL has now let it. But I don't like it. I don't like the fact too because let's not forget, this was a 22-game ban, yes. 12 of which were suspended. suspended. Yeah. So if you want to take that into it as well, I think it's a double rorting of, of this ban. And um, I don't like it. I don't think it passes the, the smell test. Yeah, I certainly think it... 10 weeks, AFL, 10 games, VFL, yeah. same thing. Mm. So I, I would have thought that he would be playing in the first week of finals, but... It's cleverly argued now, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, if, oh, you, if you're calling with so. you, you, you're clicking your heels right yep. now. To get a game of footy into him, albeit at VFL level, prior to the, the week of, uh, of finals they're about to, or four weeks of finals in their eyes, are about to endure. But I just don't like it. And maybe legally, maybe legally, they have no leg to stand on the AFL to, to deny them the opportunity. Well, they have ticked it off. So yeah. more on that as it develops.